Christy Thomas Cuddy joins us today to talk some Emory women's basketball. Coach, first off, congratulations. Uh, come off a really per a great weekend, wins over NYU and Brandeis. It's great. It's great to send, you know, for our seniors last home stand to get them two W's the way we did. And you know, I just like the way we played, the way we battled. You know, neither game was easy. I thought, you know, it was nip and tuck there. Uh, but I like the way we responded, especially in the fourth quarters, and made plays and definitely made shots when we needed to. You know, it had to be uh, really uh, a great feeling for you and your staff, as well as the kids. You've been close, you know, so many times this year in the UAA to finally, you know, get those uh, close wins. Without a doubt. I mean, again, I, all the credit goes to our players, their perseverance. They just stayed with it. Uh, you know, people are talking about practices and this and that. And I'm like, we really haven't had a bad practice throughout the UAA season. We just haven't made those plays when we needed to. And that's what was so remarkable about this last weekend. When there was never any doubt amongst any of our players or staff, we made those key plays. And it was really, a, as you mentioned, really a team effort. You know, to maybe like when I gave you a really uh, a pair of really solid outings, and you just got a lot of clutch plays from various players in those games. I like the way our team played. You know, I thought different players made big plays. Uh, you know, what I was really pleased with Jamaica is it was in all three facets. It was defense, it was rebounding, and it was scoring. I thought Michelle made some big baskets. I thought on Sunday, especially Fran and Shelly made some really big threes. Eileen's still steady at the point guard for us. You know, and obviously KJ's pressure on their guards. It's really helped us. And then coming up this weekend, your final uh, Start the final three games of the year, all on the road uh, this weekend at Carnegie and uh, Case Western. It never gets any easier. Uh, you know, Carnegie's playing really well. Took Wash U right down to the wire, was up double digits on them in the fourth quarter. So we know we have our hands full. And then obviously, very disappointed in the way we played against Case the first round. So two formal opponents uh, coming up for us. All right, Coach. Well, thanks very much for your time. I'll let you get back to work, and we'll uh, see you next week.